This video covers the teeth and the dental formula. Humans are omnivores. This means that we eat both plant material and animal material. Carnivores eat meat only. Herbivores, like our rabbit here, eat only plant material. If you examined the teeth of omnivores, carnivores and herbivores, you would see that they're quite different. They might have more of one tooth and less of another. Their teeth match their food. So basically, omnivores, carnivores and herbivores will have differing dental formulae. Let's look at human teeth. To understand the human dental formula, imagine that the mouth is cut into two halves down to the middle of the front teeth, the left and the right side. The human dental formula will discuss the teeth on one side of the mouth only, but it will reference the number of those teeth on the top and the bottom of that side. So this is my patient and I'm going to discuss the left hand side of her mouth. You can see that she has two incisors, two top and two bottom. Incisors are used for biting into food or nipping bits off. My patient has another type of tooth. She has a canine, one top and one bottom. These pointy canines are for tearing the food, particularly meat. Going to the back of my patient's mouth, you can see that she has two larger teeth, two on the top and two on the bottom, and these are known as the premolars. These premolars are for crushing and grinding food. As I reach the back of my patient's mouth, you can see that she has three molars, three top and three bottom. And these large, wide molars are used for crushing and grinding food again. So basically, to write the dental formula for my patient, I label the incisors, the canine, the premolars and the molars, top and bottom for one side only, and I put a two in front of the formula for the other side. You could be asked to match the dental formula of a particular animal to a photograph. Rabbits have very large incisors and no canines. Carnivores such as this tiger would have larger canines and usually a larger one on the bottom. That was a short video on the dental formula. This chapter ties in with human nutrition, so don't forget to revise that.